Pittsburgh detectives continue to search for a gunman after an overnight shooting on the north side. Megan Schiller gathered information all morning long and talked with one woman who said she watched the victim call for help. Late Thursday morning, police blocked off Carrington Street again to bring in a canine to search for more evidence. We had a chance to talk with an eyewitness about exactly what she heard and saw. I was dead asleep around 3.15 in the morning. I heard 7 to 10 gunshots right outside our apartment building. The shot spotter alerted police to the rapid gunfire. Almost a half dozen police cars raced to the corner of Carrington and Federal Streets. Chelsea Pryor watched from her window inside the Federal North Apartments. He was crawling. By the time they came, he was actually on all fours crawling. Um, he somehow rolled himself from the grass area to the road. So he was moving. He was conscious. Uh, I could see his phone lit up so he was making some type of call. First responders rushed the man to the hospital in critical condition, shot multiple times. Detectives put down more than 10 yellow evidence markers in the snow. A pile of glass surrounded the entrance to the Federal North Apartments. The front door shattered by a bullet. It's a great neighborhood. I love this neighborhood. The north side to me is safe and I, I still feel safe. I just went out for a run, as you can see, and I didn't feel threatened out there, but this does happen and I would love to see it stop happening. And that neighbor said this is the second shooting in the past couple months in front of the Federal North Apartments. Police say this is still under investigation. They're asking for you to call police if you have any information. Reporting on the north side, Megan Schiller, KDK news.